it's Stampin' Up! time. I wanted to show you what my uh, order was that I got from Stampin' Up! So excited. I've already actually used these. Y'all noticed my last one. Y'all see the uh, I got the, po the hole punch, some punches. This time I got the two inch circle and I got the two and a half inch circle. And I am finding these so useful. I am repurposing some cards that I've received. Okay, so it's Botanical Gardens. And I'll show you. This was just some vellum paper. I don't know how well you'll be able to see. But I'm excited. I can't wait to make some cards with that with a different color of paper underneath it. It will be beautiful. I got some of the Stampin' Up! Dimensionals. I've seen uh, Misty, the Jolly Fat Elf. She uses them on hers. And, they, and the ones that I got from Target was just so thick. And I wanted to actually test these. So I got some of the Dimensionals. I got the Big Mama Drama Elf uh, Clear Acrylic Block. This is, I know anything that I want to stamp will fit on here. And here is another punch that I also got. I got the Border Punch. This will go along with the Heart Border Punch to punch, uh, to make the cards with. Okay, and let's see here. And then I also got the 2 and 3 eighths inch scallop punch. Because so I figured this way, with the scallop and the circle punch when you're just starting out, to me, you can't go wrong because you, uh, you, you're going to be able to use, to use them. And I got me some Versamark ink. Guess you will see why. I, and, uh, you see with my Hobby Lobby haul where I got the uh, the heating tool and stuff for embossing, but you'll see in a moment uh, from another place where I got some new embossing powders. Now, I got some stamping pads. I went ahead and just got a kit, and this was, I think, the classic colors, which included the olive. Uh, the tur tempting turquoise, Pacific Point, Rich Razzleberry, Real Red, Melon Mambo, Mambo Mambo, <laughs> Bermuda Bay. Tangerine Tango, Pumpkin Pie, and Daffodil Delight. Yes. So I should have plenty of colors. Memories and Making Project Life Specialty Card Selection. Okay, this is one of my other freebies I got. I got, because I haven't never done any of the Project Lights, but I've seen other people do them. So this is like the clear... The heart's clear, so you could put it on any of the papers that you wanted. Another acetate. Look at this acetate. Isn't that beautiful? Like I said, Jock could probably tell me a lot of this stuff, what I, what you, how you would do. Oh, these are even bigger. Oh, yes. Even for, use it for Project Life. This would be, make beautiful cards, too. Oh, I love that. That is so cute. What I was most excited about I, is the stamp sets, and some of these stamp sets was also free because of my purchases. This is called Balloon Celebration. It has some sayings like happy birthday, champagne, hot chocolate. It says, it says and eat cookies and eat cake. You can put happy birthday or come, let's sit, let's sit together and drink and eat cookies or and eat cake. Uh hot chocolate, there's coffee, there's tea, there's a little bowl, there's all kind of different and there are balloons. So I'm excited about that one. 
and then the rose wonder this had some more beautiful sands on it it's got somehow god knew i needed a friend just like you with sympathy what a beautiful blessing you are to me for some things or just no words wedding wishes a beautiful rose and like a little banner stamp just beautiful and then flower now this one because this is this was one of the free ones because it says celebration on here it's the flower and fields the different flowers stamps to go on it and this is why also i will show y'all because i did I, I did choose this because as you can see this is going to be on the clear mount is what they call clear mount it's not on wood you have these that you can put on the back of it so you'll know what each one of them are and then you will put these on your acrylic block but you still won't it won't be as see-through as you get with just the poly uh photomer stamps so this will be my first one of these kind of sets so i'm excited about testing that out a lot better way to test something out with it being free <laughs> and then the next one is a beautiful ride. Hi, I knew. Y'all knew I was going to get this one. Slug bug. And then this one is picture perfect. And this actually has a way that you can do, uh, use these stamps to shade in to make, make the, rose, the roses darker with different colors. So I'm excited about trying that. And then here is another one that I got for, free from Celebration, What I Love. Know what I love? You. Thank you. It's got some pitch, uh, the leaves. And here's another rose that you can do, use different colors to make it more vibrant and more shaded. And then uh, I had to get a nice cup. Of, so you got a cup. You got you are terrific. And you. And spending time with you. It's just. There's always time for tea. Okay, so that is the Stampin' Up! Blitzy. Blitzy, if y'all, uh, I will have a link below for uh, my Stampin' Up! site if y'all want to go look up any of these and look at them and what they are. But and Blitzy is a scrapbook inside that's on there. And for and they had, I had $10 credit uh, from a referral from joining, uh, signing up for the site from a friend. And so I had that, so I went ahead and used it to get started on some of the embossing powders. And here we go. This is the first time I've ever ordered from Blixie. Blixie. This is called the Judkins Embossing Powder. Oh my God, Kaleidoscope, look at that. Is that not gonna be beautiful? And then this is Bridal Tinsel. Oh, this is going to be like a shimmery white. Y'all be able to tell more when I actually when I show y'all the cards. And this is just the uh, just the plain white embossing powder. And I couldn't, this one is called, I believe, copper. I thought that was just so pretty. And then I got just a plain black. Let's see what, what this is. Yep, just plain black. Okay, and these are the Ranger brand. This is the Judkins brand. And this black is the Zings brand. And this other is a Zing. Uh, and it is called... This is a metallic finished silver. Okay, y'all, so that is it. I hope y'all enjoyed this. Like I said, I will have the link to Blitzy down below. I will have uh, the link to uh, our uh, Stampin' Up! site down below. And I hope y'all enjoyed this, and we'll talk to y'all later. Bye! Bye.